According to official Iranian media reports on Thursday, Iran's Defense Minister Mohammad Reza Ashtiani cautioned against the viability of a proposed multinational task force, backed by the U.S., aimed at safeguarding shipping in the Red Sea, citing potential extraordinary problems. Ashtiani's remarks surfaced following the U.S.'s recent announcement of discussions with other nations to establish a task force, prompted by a series of Iran-backed Houthi attacks on ships in the Red Sea, originating from Yemen. In comments to the Iranian student news agency, ISNA, Ashtiani warned, if they pursue such an irrational course of action, they will encounter significant challenges. He emphasized Iran's dominance in the region, stating, no actions can be taken in an area where we hold considerable influence, specifically referring to the Red Sea. Ashtiani refrained from detailing Iran's potential responses to the proposed U.S.-backed Red Sea task force. U.S. National Security Advisor Jake Sullivan previously mentioned discussions with other countries regarding the formation of a maritime task force to ensure safe passage of ships in the Red Sea, without elaborating further. The Yemeni Houthis, aligned with Iran, have extended their involvement in the Israel-Hamas conflict by targeting vessels in critical shipping routes and launching drones and missiles at Israel, reaching over 1,000 miles from their base in Sana'a, Yemen's capital. In response, both American and French naval forces have bolstered their presence in the Red Sea to safeguard vessels from potential seizure or assault by the Houthis.